आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ so the question says that a square is inscribed in a circle x square plus y square minus 6x plus 8y minus 103 is equals to 0 so we are given that uh, there is a circle and whose equation is this and there is a square which is inscribed inside a circle such that its sides are parallel to coordinate axis all right then the distance of the nearest nearest vertex to the origin is equals to a part is 13 b part is under root 127 c part is under root 41 and d part is 1 so we need to find out the distance of the nearest vertex to origin all right so let us draw the scenario first that what are they trying to say so this is the scenario which is given to us in the question so uh, here somewhere there will be a center of the circle right so they are saying that uh, the sides of the square are uh, parallel to the coordinate axis so the coordinate axis will be like this uh, this would be x uh, y axis and this would be y x uh, x axis all right so so the scenario would be something like this so let us start with the question now so we are given with the equation which says x square plus y square minus 6x plus 8y minus 103 is equals to 0 so by uh, applying the completing the square method we'll be finding out the uh, center of the circle and the measurement for the radius all right so we have already uh, known this completing the square method so we just need to apply it here minus 6x so now what is the half of uh, the co coefficient of x it is 3 and the twice we need to plus uh, we need to add and subtract the twice of the half of the coefficient of x in completing the square method right so plus 9 minus 9 and what about the other coefficient of y it will be plus y square plus 8y minus or plus 16 minus 16 minus 103 is equals to 0 so now here if you can see that uh, it is uh, becoming a completing a uh, complete square so we'll be just writing it as x minus 3 whole square plus y plus 4 whole square and the remaining will be on the other side which is 128 so here if you can see then the center of the circle will be 3 comma minus 4 right what is the standard equation for the circle it it says x minus h whole square plus y minus k whole square is equals to r square right so by comparing this equation to the this uh, to the equation we have got in the question will be getting center as 3 comma minus 4 and our radius will be r is equals to under root 128 it will be is equals to 8 root 2 and we know that the diameter of the uh, circle is 2r so it will be 16 root 2 so now from here if you can see that we have got the center which is 3 comma minus 4 right and we also know the radius which is 8 root 2 so it is like this 8 root 2 right so from here if you can see this and this if we we need to find out these distances how we can do that by pythagoras theorem all right so applying the pythagoras theorem here let us take this uh, this side as x and this side as x 
all right all the sides are in a square are equal so we are taking one side as x so another will also be x so if this is the diameter this is the diameter so i was talking about if this is the diameter of the circle so we can easily find out the value for x because we know the value for diameter by pythagoras theorem we x square plus x square is equals to 16 root 2 whole square the value for diameter it will be 2x square is equals to 256 into 2 2 and 2 get cancelled and what is the value for 256 under root 256 it is 16 we will be taking the positive value as the sides of the square will always be in positive so we have got the value for the side of the square which is 16 so from here if you can see that the center the center point which we have got is 3 comma minus 4 right 3 comma minus 4 so if we need to find out the uh, vertices of this this and this these points so we can easily find out the vertices for these points as we know the distance of the sides which is 16 so from here if we need to find out the uh, distance from uh, for this point it will be this is the half since this is the center so this will be the half of the uh, side of the square right it will be 8 and this will also be 8 so 8 and 8 from here if we need to find out the distance of this so it will be 11 comma 4 how how we have 3 comma minus 4 here right we are here and we have 3 comma minus 4 so after adding 8 in the x coordinate and adding 8 in the y coordinate as well will be getting 11 comma 4 right and since this point and this point are on the same lines right so the y co uh, y coordinate will get same and the x coordinate will remain uh, sorry the x coordinate will get change and the x uh, y coordinate will remain same because they are parallel to x axis right so here we, this distance is 16 so we just need to minus uh, uh, subtract 16 from 11 from 11 so 11 minus 16 will be minus 5 and this is on the same lines for the x axis so uh, so it will remain 4 all right similarly if we need to find out this distance so now here the x coordinate will remain same and the y coordinate will get subtracted because here if on y axis you are here and you need to come here so that means you need to subtract the uh, distance from the given point so 4 minus 16 will be minus 12 and what about this point now here if you can see the y coordinate will remain same and the x coordinate will get changed and it will be minus 5 plus 16 which will give us 11 so these are the coordinates of the square which have which we have found so here if we take these points uh, as a comma b comma c so let us take uh, a this as b this as c and this as d so let us write these points as uh, here to so point a coordinates of point a is 11 comma 4 point b will be minus 5 comma 4 point c is minus 5 comma minus 12 
and point D is eleven comma minus twelve. So we need to find out the uh, distance from the origin to these vertices, right? So uh, what is the uh, coordinates for origin? Zero comma zero. So we'll be finding the distance by the distance formula, which says x two minus x one plus y two minus y one. Uh, I'm sorry. The distance formula says under root x two minus x one whole square plus y two minus y one whole square. So we just need to put the values for these uh, coordinates here in this formula, and we'll be getting the distance of OA, OB, OC, and OD. So for this, so we know that uh, origin is zero. So we'll be just squaring these uh, coordinates. All right. So here. For the first eleven square, four square, it will be one twenty one plus sixteen, which is equals to one thirty seven. For OB, it will be twenty five plus sixteen, which will be forty one. For OC, it will be twenty five plus one forty four, it will be one sixty nine. Right. You can also write it as thirteen. For OD, it will be one twenty one plus one forty four. That is two sixty five. So if you can see here, it is under root one thirty seven. It is under root forty one. It is one sixty nine under root, and it is two sixty five. So the lowest distance here is this. Right. So this is the least distance from the origin to the vertex b so let us check in the options so we have root 41 as the least distance from one of the vertices so correct option is root 41 क्लास सिक्स टू ट्वेल्थ से लेके नीट आई आई टी जे मेन्स और एडवांस के लेवल तक 10 मिलियन से ज्यादा स्टूडेंट्स का भरोसा आज ही डाउनलोड करें डाउट नेट ऐप या व्हाट्सएप कीजिए अपने डाउट्स आठ चार सौ चार सौ चार सौ पर